Hey guys, Tasha here from Stardust Gold Crochet. This week's Saturday Stitch Explorer tutorial is called the Shells and Lattice Stitch. It has lattice work through the center and it kind of looks like flowers going up. So I renamed this from Shell Network to the Lattice. I'm using a four millimeter hook and Merino Soft by Shapes. It's a three weight yarn and it's really soft and it's kind of stretchy too. All right, so also for this, I added a little bit of a single crochet border going around just to kind of enclose it. I put two single crochets um, when I got to the bottom. I put two single crochets per little lattice um, opening, but I thought it turned out nice. So to start, we're going to do a slip knot, however you like to do your slip, slip knots. And we're going to work in multiples of eight plus three. So I've got three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And I'm going to do 16 for this tutorial. You can work however many you'd like, of course. And the written pattern will be on my blog. So after you do your 16 or your multiples of eight, you're going to chain three extra and then work three more extra. We're going to work into the sixth chain from the hook. So count down six and in that sixth chain you're going to do a double crochet. So you yarn over, insert your hook, pull up a loop, pull through two and then pull through two more. So we're going to skip two chains, one and two. In the third we're going to work a double crochet. This is an easy pattern, it's all double crochets, which makes it super easy. We're actually going to work five double crochets, I'm sorry, into the same stitch. All right, so once you get your five in there, you're going to skip two and we're going to work a double crochet into the next. Here we're going to chain one, we're going to skip one chain and work a double crochet in the next. And here's where our pattern repeats. So what you do here is we're going to skip two more and then we're going to work five double crochets into the next. This pattern does, it's very easy to remember after you work the first couple of rows and you repeat row two the entire time. So it makes for a very simple pattern and it actually works up pretty fast. Okay, so we have our five. Here we're going to skip two and in the third we're going to work a double crochet. We're going to chain one, skip one, and in the last chain work a double crochet. And there's your row one. You can see it's a nice little shell pattern with lattice. So for row two, what we do first is we're going to chain four, then turn your work. We're going to skip the first double crochet and the first chain and work a double crochet into the second double crochet. Then you're going to skip two of the shell and work into the middle double crochet of that five cluster. And we're going to do five double crochets into that middle stitch. I'm going to speed up just a little bit. So we're going to skip the two, we're going to work a double crochet in the top of the next double crochet. And then we're going to chain one, work a double crochet in the top of the next double crochet. You're going to skip that other chain as well. All right, and here's our repeat again. So we skip two double crochets, work five double crochets into the center of that shell cluster from below. 
See how easy this is? And it really turns out beautiful. Looks like a baby, like a great baby blanket, or it would probably look pretty with a cardigan too. So we have our five. We're gonna skip the two double crochets and work our last double crochet of the row into the double crochet from the previous. Here we're gonna chain one to end, and then the ending, we're gonna skip two we're gonna skip one, I'm sorry, and work into the second chain down. And this one always gets me, it's hard to work through. This yarn is somewhat splitty too, so I have a little bit of trouble getting through there. And then I didn't like it, so I had to rip it back out. <laughs> Cause I see where I split the yarn. It's a great yarn to work with, sometimes. <laughs> okay, so there's our last double crochet of the round row. And you repeat row two until you reach your desired height. So you guys can end the video here or you can keep on. I'm gonna do one more row two, but that's it. You repeat row two until you reach your desired height. So for row two, again, our repeat, we're gonna chain four, turn, Skip the first double crochet and work a double crochet into the next double crochet. Then we're gonna skip two and work five double crochets into the center of the next. Once you get those five completed, you skip the two and you work a double into the next double. It split again on me, so I had to redo it. Then we're gonna chain one and work a double into the next double. And there's our repeat. So we're skipping two, working five into the center of the double crochet cluster from below the shell. We're gonna create another shell with five double crochet. And when you reach the end, you're gonna just work, skip one and then work into the second chain down. So here we're gonna skip those two of the cluster and work a double, our final double crochet of the row into the last double of the previous row. Splitty, chain one, skip the one chain and work a double into the second chain. And that's it you guys. Super easy and beautiful. I think this is one of my favorite stitches so far. All right, so please subscribe to my channel. Oops, oh, Merino Soft. The links are down below for the written pattern. And also I wanted to mention that on Monday, the 24th of June, I'm doing a patchwork mystery cow. This is called the Phoenix Square and it's a free pattern. Join the cow, there's 11, 12 designers. I'm the 11th. Um, the cow is almost over, but it goes until June 30th for me and then they'll start a new one. You can do these squares anytime you want and all the patterns are free. This one here is the Star Portal Square, which is also the first square of the cow. So I'll leave those links down below. Thanks guys. Happy crocheting.